Fires continue to burn across the region and today's near record breaking highs made the job of firefighters battling those blazes even harder. NBC 5's Cassie Nelson joins us live in studio with more. Cassie? That's right. It's perfect weather for going to the lake or the pool, but for firefighters who have to work out in this heat, it's a whole different story. Fire officials say the lower humidity causes wildfires to spread more quickly, and the high temperatures cause firefighters to get tired sooner, meaning they have to have plenty on standby. The jobs we do, it's very strenuous, just like, a, just like an athlete, and uh, the extra gear and equipment we carry, um, we just need to be, monitor our uh, hydration. We're Fire officials say structural firefighters are more at risk for heat-related illnesses because all their gear causes their core temperature to rise even before they get to the scene. And with the weather like this, this t like it is today, fire officials say it's important firefighters drink four to six liters of water a day to stay hydrated. Live in the studio, Cassie Nelson, NBC5 News.